Okay, YouTube. Um, this is my previous burner unit. Um, very simple to make, as you can see. Um, it works unbelievably well. Uh, massive amount of heat out of it. And the deal is, I want to put that in the stove, and I want to separate. Here's the stove that I've made. Um, just run through this. I've put a little bit of a, um, a glass door in it. That's a, a Pyrex dish from the uh, the kitchen and this is how I fixed it I cut a hole in it um, a little washer just to hold the uh, you know just to hold it in place I welded these bolts to the actual door and uh, and I just tightened that up there's a little bit of a gap very small gap there around it and I'll seal that with high temperature silicone uh, there's the hinge setup I made it's been out in the rain so it rusted a bit but uh, I need to get this paint off because when, when it's burning it throws out a tremendous amount of horrible smoke um, the deal is this big washer this big uh, it's got a 6 inch hole in the center and it's it's cut so that it's uh, the same diameter as the in inside of the cylinder of the propane tank um, and it's going to sit down in the middle between the two doors um, and that's it. And then the burner unit is going to push up through that. So what I'm going to do, the burner unit, if this is welded between those two doors, and the, the burner unit just pushes up through it. And that's it. And the doors work like this. So when I have the um, all the welding done, I'm going to put a little bit of a lip, you know, some steel strips, you know, that extend beyond the door, so that when I close it, it doesn't go all the way in like this and um, and also you know that I can get a nice tight seal so still to be done is uh, some handles to keep it closed and I have to weld in the big disc separator um, so that's on my to-do list now so more when I have that done okay so here's that um, separator in the, uh, in the cylinder deal is this is my burner tube hard to do this with one hand but anyway I wanted a tight fit and there you go so and it just hangs there it's a nice fit so that's the deal. That's my bottom chamber separated from the top chamber. All the air going into the top chamber will have to come through that bottom glass tube. And that gives me a waste oil burner. And then if I want to light a fire in this, I just put um, like a grate or a basket above that, uh, drop the bottom pot, and uh, the air will come up through here, combustion, and that's it. And then I can use it as a stove. Um, just an ordinary wood stove or coal or, you know, whatever you want. As I say, it's a multi-fuel stove, a to make, so, uh, propane tank for free. Uh, I went looking in the kitchen <laughs> and I stole this, uh, you know, this uh, Pyrex dish, and uh, and I'm gonna uh, set this up now and shortly. We'll see what it's like burning waste oil.